as play somehow is to to bring creation into being. So you know, to add to life, to add to the aliveness. So it's also a, a loving act. And you know, loving acts are directed towards other. Loving acts are not directed to yourself; they are directed towards other. You are going to give life to someone. You're playful by giving someone the occasion to feel a little bit lighter. So you know, it's other directed. And the great thing is that even if you feel miserable, you can still treat others nicely. Even if you're inside, you feel like. Hello. You can still be playful. You can do it because it's not about you. It's about it's about life itself. It's about the life in everyone. So that's that's something which is possible. And it might be a stretch, and then you have to somehow kick yourself to hey, try to be playful. But it works. And the interesting thing is then this playfulness will mirror back to you on you, and then you actually you will be surrounded by playful people, and then you will feel a little bit better. <laughs> The, the, the interesting thing about love is, you can produce it. You know, you don't have to wait for it because it's just this fleeting feeling. And when you feel it, you can do it. And when you don't feel it, you're helpless. You can produce it because love is about other. That's the wonderful thing. We are suffering from the narcissistic pest, and it it can help us to turn towards others. And the other thing is the source which desires life to be, which desires to give life. Is something we can connect to, and caring about others, turning towards others helps us to connect to it. But we can connect to it anyway. You know, there is a source which desires to give life, which will be there regardless. Whatever will come, this source is there, and we can tap into it, and we can make ourselves its servants. And this makes you feel right. <laughs>